on already. I welcome oh. everybody. <laughs> so I welcome, of course, Nicoletta Sanz, and I'm so happy that she could accept my invitation for the online interview today. As um, we know since really that time, since 1980, <laughs> we met for the first time in uh, Vienna at the Third World Harp Congress. And now we are here online on stream and we are remembering not only the Third World Harp Congress, but we are pulling the, the first worldwide online harp congress, which I tried to create for all of you to, to make the life a little bit nicer in these days. And really, Nicoletta is one of the main person who I remember, <laughs> not only because of her wonderful playing at the Focus on News, but also because she she's and she was always such a lovely person. So I'm so happy and welcome, Nicoletta, that you are with us. <laughs> Thank you so much. Uh, hello, everybody. It's a, a real pleasure to for me to be here. Uh, even if uh, on, on, just on live, on, online and uh, on screaming on the screen, and thanks to Jana for this uh, idea. I think it's uh, really a wonderful idea to make a little bit uh, happiest uh, this uh, strange and uh, very and some, somehow very sad days because uh, don't, we don't uh, we are safe, we are healthy, but we don't have to rem to forget all other people who are suffering and uh, or all people who are. Uh, uh, fighting against uh, this disease uh, with the, the against the covid uh, or they lose uh, some very dear person uh, mm -hmm. about for this disease so uh, please uh, cross finger because uh, i wish everybody a full healthy life uh, and uh, we will uh, we will uh, go away and it will be better as yeah. I, we hope uh, as soon as possible <laughs> Oh, and of course, in Italy, it was the worst case at the very beginning already. So you went really yes. through the very difficult time for a long time. You were saying about 60, 68 days already? 68 days, exactly, exactly. I mm -hmm. we closed uh, everything. Uh, we are we are living in a lockdown since uh, 23rd February. It means really six uh, 66 days, something like that. And uh, all our lives are, are completely changed, of course. Mm -hmm. And so, as everybody, I'm teaching online. I'm working online. Uh, we have to discover. <laughs> I'm not so uh, so so good with the internet, or uh, I mean with the uh, uh, all these kind of platforms uh, to to work online, but uh, as everybody, we um, we are artists, so we have to <laughs> to be artistic also in this in this situation. And so it's very important. It was very important for me to keep uh, in co contact with all my colleagues, with all my friends, uh, and trying to share experiences uh, in uh, teaching online. What's the best way to do it? Uh, what's the best platform? Uh, what's uh, also the most official? Because you know we are doing a uh, uh, our uh, academies has to recognize our work and mm -hmm. so how is the best way to recognize our work uh, and and etc 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 at the beginning uh, uh, i must say i was uh, a little bit confused as everybody but uh, actually i know i'm very well organized i have my schedule <laughs> as everybody uh, a weekly schedule so all my students know exactly when they have they have to to call me or they have to be re ready in front of the computer or the smartphone or whatever and uh, and we are going uh, we're we going on with our lessons with our our programs so and i know and of course it's not only me i know all my colleagues uh, a lot of harpists uh, in italy i know a lot of harpists in italy and uh, all we are doing that uh, and we are sharing it's very very nice because you know um, we are created a chat uh, on whatsapp uh, all uh, most of all uh, all teachers uh, rpc teacher in italy and uh, this is very useful because we are sharing experiences but we are sharing also uh, music because a lot of us uh, maybe forgot or, le or left some music uh, in um, in classrooms and so we are, we have not the material with war which mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. uh for students and so we are sharing oh please do you have uh, somebody has uh, i don't know uh, la rivière technique uh, or somebody has uh, this piece or the other piece and we are sharing a whatsapp uh, pdfs <laughs> <laughs> and so i think uh, in some somehow this uh, this uh, strange and ugly situation is um, moving us and creating a, a very a very strong group uh, cooperating so i have to say say Thank you to all my colleagues uh, from Italy uh, and uh, bravo because we are doing, I think this is very good and this is very important for our students, especially for the harp and for our students. 
Absolutely, I totally agree. And I think that this time changes us also as a human being because we feel that we need to really help each other more and just to be more together, like to feel really more more as a compact compact society. So I'm I'm really glad that I can hear yeah. that it works everywhere like that, and it's wonderful. And of course, I'm so glad that you can also talk about if you have any memories from the Third World Heart Congress. Oh. If you remember how did you feel at the time or if oh. it was your first time to perform. <laughs> Of course, I have a, I have huge memories. I think it was a, an incredible experience. Uh, I I was 19 at that time. I just got my diploma one month before uh, with Patrizia Tassini at the Udine Conservatory, and then it, it was like it was for you my very first uh, uh, experience in uh, such a stage because uh, it's an incredible stage to play with in. Uh, and um, really, uh, I don't, I can't remember if it was really frightened, it, if I really realized what I was doing at that time. I have just, I just remember that I wanted to play as well as I, I could. Uh, but um, if I was frightened, I don't remember, really. I was really, oh, you know, yeah, it's gonna be, uh, it's my time, it's my turn. And um, I, I must recognize when you sent me the, the video, I was looking at this young girl, so unexperienced. It was so clearly unexperienced girl. <laughs> and looking at you, I just, okay, little poor girl. <laughs> but you were so cute. You were so beautiful. And I remember really, it was such a wonderful time to meet you there because I remember like like yesterday and it's 33 years ago. It's absolutely amazing. That 33, this years, 33 years ago. And uh, no, I, uh, as you told, uh, as you told, uh, I was talking yesterday with Stephanie. Uh, really, uh, I think everybody of us, uh, of us uh, performers uh, of the Focus on Youth, uh, didn't realize that it was the very first time of the Focus on Youth uh, was running on. Mm -hmm. And um, but I was feeling like you, like everybody, I guess, uh, like Alice in Wonderland, because uh, I remember myself walking around in this perfect uh, Ausper Palace, uh, the main the main uh, uh, location for uh, for the Congress. Uh, beautiful palace uh, do you remember what this huge uh, big halls uh, so with all, all wooden decoration perfect uh, and uh, looking around uh, watching music i've never heard about uh, trying uh, all kind of harps uh, uh, i remember um, alfredo orlando ortiz that i know that you are going to guess um. I remember Alfredo, it was such an incredible experience. I bought, I think, at that time, two tapes, two, two cassettes, because mm -hmm. at that time, cassettes, no. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> No, absolutely. And uh, uh, Alfredo Rolando Ortiz, of course, Marisa Robles, the first concert with this incredible red dress and how the temperament, the passion, the passion she, she put into the into the performance. I was just, yeah, that's a perfect way to play the harp. No, so I really, I really enjoyed. And um, and you know, also meeting so many. Um, how do you say, uh, monsters uh, of the harp uh, and masters, of course, like Verde Dulova, Fia Bergaut, uh, Suzanne McDonald, and all the others, uh, Eileen Malone, all the others were there. Mm -hmm. You know, the gotha, the gotha of the harp world, no? Uh, I say, I'm here, oh, wow. <laughs> And I, 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 so I immediately fall in love with the world of Congress, <laughs> and I'm still in love with the world of Congress. As as a, you know, I'm part of the board of directors of the World of Congress in representation of the heart of the Italy, and so I'm, I really, I'm really happy. And when they elected me, I was, I was elected um, six, six, seven years ago. It was a, such a big joy for me because I say, okay, uh, now I'm on the other part of the yeah. of the table. <laughs> And it's it's nice. It's nice. It's wonderful to have such people in in the board. And 
because of course it makes the the program of, of the whole congress much more important for everybody you know when there are really people who we know and who we are really having as admirers as well so that it's really very important for everybody for the young generation so how do you see the future for the congress we have unfortunately this year we could not attend yeah. the this because it has been also postponed for the next year but uh, do you think that it will be then postponed again for three years or after Cardiff it will be in two years after after that oh I don't know this is very uh, uh, we have to decide <laughs> about yeah. it we will have our online meeting in July when it mm -hmm. was scheduled for the before mm -hmm. Cardiff Congress we will have at the same time uh, our board uh, board of directors uh, online meeting so we will discuss about about this but uh, uh, next year cardiff will be and so if uh, somebody was thinking uh, i will go i will not i won't go please join the harp world of congress because actually um we are still discussing if uh, there is any um there is still uh, is it still important to attend the world of congress uh, because we have uh, despite uh, all devices uh, all opportunities we have to listen music uh, live music or streaming music uh, or uh, recording uh, from from live concerts on youtube uh being uh, present at a live concert live concert is something that uh, any kind of recording even if it's perfect could substitute absolutely no live concert live concert is live concert and the, the feeling of the congress it's absolutely unrepeatable it's so different and so unique that really if anybody were not a, was not able to attend any any time the congress do it at least once you will fall in love because the same happened to me when i fall so much in love with, with the congress in in vienna i decided that i want to do the congress in prague so it has happened 12 12 years later that i arranged the congress in prague afterwards so you you really fall in love with the congresses immediately exactly and uh, uh, I, I I went uh, after Vienna I went to Paris uh, to play as well in focus on youth uh, and then I attended Copenhagen Dublin uh, uh, Amsterdam Sydney Hong Kong uh, unfortunately I couldn't come to Prague because at that time I, I skipped uh, the the congresses between Copenhagen and Dublin because at that time I was a uh, uh, first harp in the Slovenian Philharmonic Orchestra in Ljubljana mm -hmm. and uh, every year in July exactly during the period of the, the 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 period of the schedule in which um, uh, the congresses are scheduled uh, I was uh, uh, it was the last tournée of the year and so I couldn't <laughs> I couldn't leave the orchestra because it was my job. Uh, and so that's why I didn't attend uh, uh, congresses between Copenhagen and, and, uh, and, um, and Dublin. But, uh, and I'm very sorry I couldn't have come to Prague, of course. But we met last year, last September in Prague. No, Jana? That's true, absolutely. <laughs> Not in our park congresses, but we met last year in Prague. We met last year in Prague and we met before in Italy as well. So we yeah of times to meet between the 33 years so that's really very unique yeah. and really beautiful about this yeah so yeah. And just tell me what is your job now of course when when you are not not playing uh, now at home <laughs> only during the COVID. so not in the orchestra but you are not in 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 ljubljana anymore right no 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 no. i left the orchestra uh, almost 20 years ago a uh, okay. little less and um because of love I'm, I got married and it, it, my husband didn't want to, but I decided to, to, to create a family. And so I left the orchestra and, uh, and then I start uh, teaching that uh, another part of my life. So I'm, and it's another part of my life. My life is divided into several parts and this is the part of my life. And uh, I love teaching. I am really happy. Of course, I'm still playing. I didn't. I, I like playing. <laughs> I, I, I'm trying to do uh, as uh, as much as I can, uh, but um, no uh, orchestra and teaching wasn't uh, wasn't complementary. It wasn't so easy to manage, especially in Italy, because in Italy you need to be more you, you need to be very present. Uh, they ask you to be every week, uh, and so um, for the, with a, a symphony orchestra, you know, uh, it's very difficult to manage, especially if you are in two different uh, places. So if you have the orchestra on some somewhere and uh, teaching you know you know i don't have to tell you <laughs> you know better than me <laughs> Absolutely. but what are you teaching now uh, i'm teaching in trieste my birthplace 
One so, of yeah. To, to your place where you were born and your family yes. there as well. It's yeah, exactly, exactly, exactly. That's so, wonderful. and I'm very happy because, uh, um, okay, I feel the, the heritage of my very first professor was Evelina Vio. And uh, I was the professor of also Patrizia Tassini. Then I got the I, I got my diploma with Patrizia Tassini, mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. I played with her a lot. And uh, we have to we should play in Cardiff too, but we will play next year. <laughs> After, uh, what, yeah, is your, yeah. what is your program in Cardiff? What will you play? Oh, we will play Italian music for two arts, also a new piece written for us. Mm -hmm. and, uh, and we are looking forward. And so we, we, we just uh, play next year, <laughs> as everybody of us, as everybody of us. But I, I have to thank Karel and all the uh, Cardiff committee, uh, organizing committee because they, I know they did a huge work to move and to rebook all, all um, all venues places uh, mm -hmm. to to all venues uh, all places or, or orchestral theaters uh, to make uh, the car the the congress possible in 2021 so big, bra great. big big bravo absolutely big bravo because i can imagine how it was really difficult to do all this job because it's twice twice as much job again but as yeah. you already once you have to do it once and more and once more so i really admire also a lot this this work which they have done because yeah. I know it by myself how much work is. <laughs> of course, of and course. This Worldwide Harp Congress is a lot of work, but it's really pleasure. It always makes pleasure. And that's why we are doing it. And it must be. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. You know, I think I think it's such a, okay. Somebody um, uh, can think can think could think that uh, it's just uh, okay. We are making many harpies together. We are just playing uh, for our pleasure. Uh, just making how the harp is beautiful. The harp is beautiful, and uh, I love the phrase you put uh, at the beginning of the harp channel because the harp is the royal instrument, and I agree totally. And uh, so um, we don't have to forget that somebody somebody as uh, more important than me to uh, write, uh, wrote this uh, the same words uh, uh, we have to think about uh, Elia Paris Alvars or Nicolas Chasboxa that uh, want they do they did all they could to put really the harp at the same level level of the of the piano and i think they reached this uh, this uh, this aim on you know, this point uh, so absolutely so it's very nice <sighs> Okay, but you have to talk also. I don't have to talk no, all the, no, the no, time. No. <laughs> <laughs> you have time now to talk to us. And of course, I would like to ask also people who are listening to us, who are with us. We have some viewers here also. So please write the messages. We will be happy to answer because we have an option also to write and we see the messages. So we thank you very much for all your hellos and uh, the comments. It's wonderful that you can, uh, can, can really have time also to now watch us. But don't miss this opportunity to to ask Nicoletta when she is with us here and uh, ask her questions because this is very unique and I'm very glad that we can have this time together and today that the connection is also better I I was really worried that's why I moved also to another place to to be able to to have secure we were we were very good very good students so we 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 were online of half an hour before very very good harpists you know to tune for tuning uh, instead of tuning the harps for tuning we are used to be on time, right? We are used to be on time. <laughs> That's very true. Yeah, but it's really good that we can, today we can normally talk and we can normally discuss and of course it's uh, lovely. And what your plan after the um, pandemic, uh, this, um, this situation now in pandemia in Italy, when it stopped or when it will go through your, what are your plans now? Will the school start also or do you think that the school will oh. not no no actually uh, okay we are waiting for uh, for um, for official informations but uh, mm -hmm. as uh, as i heard yesterday with my i had a talk with my dean uh, it seems that we will reopen on september uh, we will have our all final final exams uh, for uh, for bachelors and for masters of course uh, in mm -hmm. july because they have to they need to have this exam, okay. but uh, all other people, I mean, front, uh, front, frontal lessons and uh, live lessons will be, I think, uh, September, no, no, 
no, no, before. Also schools, uh, also schools, because, uh, you know, I think uh, um, maybe it could be very prudent, but uh, I think it's better to, to wait a little bit more. Mm -hmm. It's difficult, uh, it's difficult for teenagers uh, a lot, I know, but uh, maybe it's better to be, to go down calm, 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 mm -hmm. and uh, be a little, it's, we don't know anything about this virus. We don't know anything about this disease. So uh, I don't know. It's it's difficult. Anyway, I'm practicing, as everybody's doing. Um, I'm doing a lot of technique of some of my students is present. Uh, mm -hmm. So <laughs> because technique is always very good. Uh, OK? <laughs> needs to be it needs to be the base for everything of course but it's really great time now for everybody that we can really spend and uh, time have really patience for everything what we need to do really not in a hurry but in in our time so it's really good and i'm just really surprised that you can do the on uh, you will not do the online exam right you will do the presence okay exam. i i will not do a, uh, i will do an online exams just for a theoretical um, subject uh, i have to they my students have to do but mm -hmm. online exams no mm -hmm. no online exams no actually no at for the moment no then we will see i hope that in september we will have a normal exam right but okay. online exams i know that uh, uh, they're planning for um, for high schools uh, the, mm -hmm. the last year of high school, so they are planning uh, online exams, and it will be very difficult, I think. Because, you know, okay, actually, we are going very well with the connection, but sometimes, uh, you know, also see with students, uh, somebody is, is a very good connection, somebody is very bad internet connections. Mm -hmm. And so, I don't know, I don't know. We will see, it. we have to... Com like combine all these things which are coming now. Uh, we got some uh, uh, some message there. Hello, <laughs> Mario. It's wonderful. We will see each other also very soon. No, <laughs> Mario. <laughs> so nice to hear to see you. Yo, <laughs> my our best friend. I mean, you know, when I I saw I said the first time I sit down at uh, the table uh, for the thirty first meeting of the board of directors. You know, me remembering the very first focus on youth, you know, Mario told me, come here, come here. <laughs> <laughs> he wanted me and Angel, our dear Angel, and wanted me and Angel with him to make the, the mafia. <laughs> 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 the Latin mafia, isn't it, Mario? Do you remember? <laughs> <laughs> he's so and he was so charming you will see we have i have yeah. this video he was not performing unfortunately mario at the congress but he was speaking there about the electronic harps and yeah. i have it will be also presented in the now in the coming days so you will see him he was really already at the time he was a very charming man so we are yeah. very, very happy that you are here with us mario so many greetings too from us <laughs> Yeah, absolutely. But okay, if you want, okay, we can go, can go. We can go back to our memories because uh, <clears throat> we are telling our ages. But okay, uh, <laughs> we don't care. We, we don't, don't care. care. So we don't. We don't care. And okay, uh, thirty-three years ago. Well, uh, we were like Alice in Wonderland, both of us. Uh, we were enjoying so much, uh, touching all kinds of harps, uh, knowing a lot of people, meeting a lot of people. And um, what, I, what else? Do you remember the wonderful, um, uh, the wonderful tour we had in Schönbrunn? Of course. Yeah, of course. There was so many. I must say, Josef Molnar did such a fantastic job for Oof. that time. Can you imagine? Because it was so everything. I felt so personal at that Congress. It was everything so like really like a home, like a family, because everything was so compact. It was not in a really huge halls in except the first beginning to the opening concerts. But everything else was so really intimate in the way of, of uh, having the choice of the uh, of the venues. So it was really so beautiful. And his also his personality of Mr. Molnar was so so close so really warm yeah. so yeah I, really for this that time it was absolutely unique 
And we have Elena Caniboni there. I can see. Hello, Elena. We will see also very soon online. So I'm very looking forward and greetings. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, of course. And, and you remember also the um, and also the the the, the last uh, the last tour was in Greensling. Do you remember? In this typical this typical place uh, out of Vienna. I. Mm -hmm. I'm not so good in geography, so don't ask me if north, south, west. I don't remember. But it, it was a wonderful place, like a to um, typical restaurant uh, where they were serving, serving of course, uh, um, Austrian food and uh, the wine, the white wine, grizzling wine. Uh, I remember because it was, I think it was well, maybe the first time I, I drank uh, something like that. <laughs> and I was very happy about it and very, very you know, hoo -hoo, uh, because I was young, of course. But it was uh, also some, uh, some, uh, some Austrian music uh, with harp. Uh, okay, anyway, it was great. Uh, it was great. Uh, and the Schembrun concerts, if I, w I well remember, mm -hmm. they were replied twice. They exactly. played twice because so many people attended the cons congress and uh, a lot of people booked these concerts. And mm -hmm. I remember also uh, yesterday, Stephanie was talking about uh, Martin Gelio. Mm -hmm. And uh, I think she, she died in one year later. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And, I don't have the recordings of, of this. Uh, I have from Schönbrunn. I have that concert. But it's also not complete, unfortunately, because when it has been uh, reversed to the uh, to the DVD, it has been somehow blocked and it has not been unfortunately done until the end. But I have at least some kind of some kind of taste from that concert at the, from some of the performers. So it's not always complete, but at least we have some kind of view and the atmosphere we can feel. From yeah, that. because it was really incredible. Uh, this this concert. I, I remember Res Martin Gelione when one year, one year later I knew that she do, she died. Mm -hmm. I I remember her way of playing. Uh, so intimate, so intimate. No, so mm -hmm. very nice, very nice. Okay, stop. I will cry. Uh, <laughs> People we miss, and that's why I feel that really uh, I'm so happy that these uh, memories of the videos exist because there is really I would say maybe 70, 80 percent of the videos with the people who we don't have with us here anymore. So that's yeah. why it is something so so unique also for the young generation because they only heard about them but they were not able to hear them anytime. Before. Of course, Vera Dulova, for, uh, Vera Dulova too. Exactly, she also I, was incredible. And there was Tatiana Tower as well with her yeah, the same concert, and they, they were playing together. So these these are, and she also unfortunately left the earth very soon as a young lady. So it was, it's yeah. everything. So so I think it's really, I'm happy that I can share this with you. Yeah, I'm I'm also happy because uh, sometimes you know uh, we forgot also who was the founder founder of uh, the World of Congress. Uh, mm -hmm. uh, maybe we can we can. Talk about it about Fia Bergaut. Fia Bergaut is also another lady, another big lady who lived left us a lot of a lot of time ago, and uh, uh, the World of Congress becomes from one from uh, her idea from the uh, I don't know how to say music uh, heart weeks uh, in Quickoven in, in the Netherlands. And um, Mario, if I'm wrong, please correct me. Uh, <laughs> But it's very true. We will have also panel discussion there, which was uh, dedicated to the famous harpist at that time. And there yeah. are all the people who are sitting sitting on the table and who are speaking. They are really these these big icons of us, of us, the legend. Also, Fia is there, and it's so touching to see them. Like that, yeah. they are there. There, you can just almost, you know, feel them. It's yeah. really something very special. So. She was a wonderful lady. She was absolutely, absolutely amazing. Amazing, really amazing, amazing. But if you remember well, our uh, the notes uh, for us uh, performers of mm -hmm. uh, the World of uh, Focus Youth were made by Susan McDonald, Eileen mm -hmm. Malone, uh, Fia Bergaut, and Vera Dulova. <laughs> Nicoletta, uh, Mario just wrote that you are never wrong. <laughs> <And> <laughs> He knows, he knows. <laughs> and he's right. You are never broke either, Mario. 
<laughs> big hugs, Mario, big hugs. <laughs> <laughs> it's lovely. Really, we were last year. We were together at the at the jury in the jury of the USA International Camp Harp. Yeah. So we spent also the week together. It was always this. This these people are so always making such a wonderful time. So. Yeah, they're there. <laughs> Absolutely. Yeah, it's great. Yeah. Yo, I'm never wrong. Thank you, Mario. <laughs> So, 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 just to to refresh, you know, because young students they don't know uh, how many things they have now, how many possibilities they have to 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 download music. I mean, the IMSLP or archive dot org, two big big website uh, mm -hmm. where every student can find or can search some music, but we didn't have it. Mm -hmm. We have to, we have to, 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 to please to some somebody is this going uh, abroad to to bring us music, and so in Vienna I remember that I spent uh, so much money. My mother told me no, Nicolette. I say yes, mommy, and I bought so much music <laughs> because it was quite impossible for you. You were talking about 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 Prague, but you know also in Italy we don't have we didn't have so many uh, stores for art music. Mm -hmm. uh, and so we have to order in uh, England or uh, United U United Kingdom, sorry, uh, or USA, and uh, it was very difficult. Or, or France, of course. Mm -hmm. and, and so uh, all this kind of music that you can take uh, physically, take uh, and read the uh, sight reading on on the harp because you had, had always a harp mm -hmm. close to the note. You remember close to notes to to yeah. note stands, and good. so you could yeah and you so you could try and say okay that's for me no that's not for me or maybe it could be interesting i will take home and uh, actually they just um, i know my students okay prof uh, um, okay professor i will i will uh, i will look in the in internet if i find something and we don't we didn't have this it no, was this. neither with the music, neither with the recordings, neither with yeah. anything. Everything. I mean, how much time we could have spent for for you know searching for something what we really needed. Now the people has it immediately. They can find it right away when they want. They have it in one minute. They can find everything. We had to wait for the music. We had to search for the music if we could have find. But of course, internet didn't exist, so we had to search in the shops. So also time to go to the shops and if there are some or are order and waiting until it will arrive. All these excitements which um, the young at least yeah. At least one month, at least one month to reach, to receive music. So if you are were planning to to do something uh, or some competition, you had to plan how before you have to order music to be prepared for the competition, mm -hmm. and uh, all information weren't so fast as as today. Absolutely. And maybe yeah, maybe today we have too many informations. Uh, if uh, you ask me, but and it's difficult. It's difficult to. Um, to decide which is the, the right one and which is the best one for you in that moment. And uh, but if you want it, if we wanted to do something, we have to search, we have to look for, and uh, and we have to want it to look. Mm -hmm. Absolutely, absolutely. I, yeah. I also remember that in uh, Vienna it was the first touch of uh, meeting the trolley for the harp because I have not been able to even realize that something exists to move the harp with the trolley. Ah, we, have, yeah. we have always used, the, my father was always carrying the harp to my mother and to myself as well. And of course, then we saw the trolleys. It was totally unique for everything. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, I'm just, I'm just laughing because I, 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 I read the Nicoletta, you're never wrong. You're right. <laughs> Mario <laughs> comments. <laughs> No, the trolley. And then I uh, wait. Yesterday, uh, um, rightly, Stephanie remembered um, Harvey Griffin. Mm -hmm. Harvey Griffin. The first time for me too to to listen for uh, electro electro acoustic harp and somebody playing and singing pop music with the black the the white suit and the hat 
on in the, on the 23 and playing oh and playing take five and playing take five you remember indeed, take five indeed, indeed but he was amazing you know and i have a story with him because mm. I did not speak uh, i have not spoken english at that time and uh, i was only speaking german and i i was 16 and i i was just like so impressed and as you said that that time was no C cds no dvds only the cassettes so i i wanted to go after the concert to ask him for the recording and as i did not speak uh, any english i okay. asked my father from far when i was in the queue please how to say do you have tape so I, I i didn't know understood the tape i understood only time this is the way a word which i knew time so i said like do you have time <laughs> 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 you know, and he, he with his black face, like, oh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> I did not know what I said, actually. So it was really funny. Yeah, so it was a very big experience <laughs> with this Harvey Griffin, and he was absolutely fantastic. <laughs> So I I don't want to 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 make <clears throat> to make a mistake. So uh, I thank of of course also my my teacher Elena Zaniboni, Mr. Elena Zaniboni, who is present uh, at this interview. So thank you very much because I owe her to be to be member of the board of director of director, and it's uh, correct and important for me to 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 say this. Uh, in public <laughs> that uh, thanks mrs zaniboni for this and no no not only for this but you know uh and uh, i'm i'm very i'm very happy that you will uh, broadcast also her concert uh, at the concert she gave uh, in vienna so uh, it's important for us uh, to 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 re review uh review some some old concerts uh, also you know it's funny because i was uh, looking also uh, our dresses Mm -hmm. how we were <laughs> what we were wearing <laughs> which was the fish on that time terrible and uh, another 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 funny story that i told you i typed you yesterday on on the messenger is about uh, sarah bryan um <laughs> Yesterday I was watching I was watching the video uh, with uh, Stephanie Angel and uh, Sarah, and my husband just uh, came uh, came around and uh, told, told me, "And uh, which is the, what are you playing there? I'm not, <laughs> it's not me. It's you." I say no, look, Sarah Bryan, and the same stuff happened to me to Sarah all the time during the Congress, uh, because we were all. Almost the same, and the same, the same kind of hair, long hair, the same way of wearing the hair, and the, the same, maybe the same size, something like that. Everybody, Sarah, no Nicoletta, and to, to Sarah, Nicoletta, no Sarah, and so we became like friends during the Vienna, the Congress in Vienna, for this reason, because they were mixed up, and like thinking that we were sisters or relatives somehow. <laughs> I remember that very well. I mean, it's <laughs> you will see today, you will see Nicoletta at the performance and you will only really understand how what we are talking about because it's really very true. <laughs> it's funny, it's funny. But my husband was very funny yesterday saying, Do you, are, you, are you wearing your glasses, please? <laughs> I'm, no, you do. <laughs> That's wonderful. I just see that we have there also a message from, from Sionet. So hello to her as well. We will see each other also online. So I'm very looking forward. And um, I'm so really, I'm so pleased that um, many people who already know about their performers, performances on this um, online harp congress uh, that uh, are so happy about this and that they are so touched to see them from that time uh, because some of them even told me that they don't have any recording at all from that period of time so it is uh, very unique also for them and honestly i can't even explain by words how happy it makes me that when i make you happy so i hope that really you will all enjoy uh, this this now it will be 16 days so that we will all have wonderful memories and we will come back as nostalgia but still it's like yesterday i feel really yeah i think i think uh, it would be interesting if somebody uh who's not online could ask us something more about uh, this period because we are talking and we are okay maybe i don't want to to annoy anybody you know <laughs> but if uh, somebody could have uh or also some question or how the congresses uh, changed from the past till now. 
um, what the, the Congress or the World of Congress is doing, uh, uh, like uh, like World of Congress as uh, corporation and Board of, uh, of Directors is doing uh, to to renew the harp, uh, to make also the harp very important in the world, uh, in the music world. Mm -hmm. um, we are here for, also for this. You, with your experience uh, of organizer of a Congress, uh, me as my with my little experience as a member of the board of directors so we are here and uh, and uh, waiting for your questions <laughs> i must say that really the the congress has developed a lot since that time because it has uh, been as you said it started from the harp weeks only and it was some kind of little festival of the harp but it became to be much bigger already in vienna i think that the vienna was the kind of start of making number one yeah number, like number zero mm. exactly even there were two before but i think that the vienna was really the main one of of where it came it came higher and higher and i remember i have also the recordings from paris I uh, and there I have many many really these names which I have unfortunately not from Vienna but I have there from from Paris so if uh, there will be time and I will be able to do it I will still follow this with, <laughs> with Paris recording because I think that this is something what should come uh, alive for everybody it's 30 years ago so I hope nobody can uh, say that I'm doing something wrong and I hope that everybody will be almost happy that they can see it and I I again repeat that if I see we are all not perfect, we, 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 we are trying to be perfect, but we are human beings. So, of course, it can happen that some of them had some mistakes, but believe me, I am trying to cut everything so that you will not have any troubles about uh, feeling that you, you know, remember that you did not play well. You will always play well on the recordings <laughs> because I'm trying to do it the best way for you. So, of course, it was not your case, Nicoletta. Your performance was so fantastic and I really remember it. No honestly i know that really even the young generation now when they will watch they will be impressed because it's uh, you play the peschetti sonata and uh, we know that uh, there is tricky place for many young people to, in the first movement so with the pedals so it can happen that it can be very tricky but uh, in your case it was absolutely a piece of cake it was nothing it was so easy for you <laughs> <laughs> yeah it was funny uh no it's but, okay um, I, I i agree with the the, um, the the speech you had i mean the um, the things you you said about the development of the congresses so actually i i um, I'm very happy that the Focus on Youth concerts are um, running all day uh, during the Congress and they uh, are one of the most important uh, appointments of each uh, World of Congress. Um, I must say that I was very, if uh, you allow me, uh, I, was, I was very proud in Hong Kong with the I was presenting at one of my students, Irene Pauletta, and she performed uh, during a Focus Youth uh, concert in Hong Kong. And it was, uh, you asked me before, uh, almost uh, half an hour. Oh, 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 we are talking so long. Uh, <laughs> you asked me before if I was, uh, which kind of feeling I had uh, or what I remember about my feelings in Vienna. I don't remember about Vienna. I remember perfectly how was, I, I was feeling in Hong Kong before Irene has to play. Uh, it was worth that for me, <laughs> but I was very happy that I, am, I was in the other side. And uh, not only for my students, but also, um, especially for all young students who are going to play next year in Cardiff, not this year, but next year in Cardiff, and they've been chosen, selected, because I remember, please, that the Focus Youth is just, just a, a teacher call uh, the organizer and say, oh, oh, hey, how are you? I'm a wonderful student uh, who would like to play the Focus Youth. No, it's not this, this way. You have to prepare actually a video we we have to prepare a cassette a tape but actually they have to prepare a video without any cut without any editing and send the the, the videos uh, plus uh, curriculum vitae plus plus uh, some recommendation letter or presentation letter of several artists teacher musicians whatever and uh, and one year before the congress uh, and then they are listened very carefully listen by the committee and the committee is formed uh, because it's composed by several people from all over the world uh, of the board of directors members of the board and the, of the corporation 
and uh, this is a committee for the focus of youth concerts and they are selected and uh, listen and re-listen and re-listen and re-listen and then selected so it's it's like a, a, a sort of, of competition somehow because if you are selected it means that you have something that impressed the jury because it's a jury Absolutely. And uh, I think uh, uh, is uh, um, the opportunity given to students, also to the youngest, even if they are not perfect, even if uh, they are not playing, uh, I don't know, so impressed, impressive uh, pieces, masterpieces, but just uh, something very, very small, very little, but very musical and very well played. Uh, they will be selected because I listen. I I have the chance to to listen to some very young um, Chinese student in Hong Kong, nine years old. Mm -hmm. I don't remember what she played. She played something by Zabelo Asselman, mm -hmm. and but she played so nice, so musically, and the, her performance, the her total performance, the presence on the stage, uh, the, the the dress. Uh, she was so cute uh, and the sound so nice. Uh, let us say, okay, she's nine years, but uh, she has to be there. She has she had to have this chance. Mm -hmm. And this is an incredible chance. Uh, so I really suggest and, and invite all young students who want to, to live uh, this kind of um, experience, even if not playing at the focus of youth, but try to attend an, a, a World of Congress. We need young people because young people will bring memories as you are doing now or we are doing now we are sharing memories but we are sharing memories about also performances uh, historical performances somehow because of the our um, big names of the harp world who made very very uh, important things for the harp world i'm annoying people no it's too long <laughs> It's very interesting, and I'm very thankful for everything we are checking, checking because I think that what is uh, somehow missing in this time of, of I mean, it's a social thing, thing that uh, they are really forgetting those really big names from the past, which actually we would not be here without them. And I think okay. that they deserve, deserve to be mentioned more than than uh, it is uh, now in uh, common. But I think that this is also opportunity to come them back to really know that there were fantastic players already in the past, and that only because of them, the young generation plays like they play now. Because without them, we would not be there where we are, like the uh, the harp community. So uh, we should be really thankful and not be forgetting these people only because they are young ones. So I think that uh, this deserves to be more mentioned as well, and of course supporting the young ones, but not forgetting the old ones. Because without no. them, we would not be here. Exactly. You remember, you know, Ayana, I, rem I will always remember I attended the concert of uh, Ruggero Ricci. Ruggero Ricci was uh, an old, uh, very famous uh, um, violin, uh, violinist, uh, Italo, uh, Italo, uh, of it 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 uh, Italo American uh, mm -hmm. person, uh, who, has, who had a concert in uh, Ljubljana. Um, 25 years ago when he was very old he was around uh, i think 80 85 86 or something like that and he had a recital with uh, all uh, paganini's caprichos mm -hmm. 86 years you can imagine it. it's not very easy and i remember um a colleague of mine a violinist uh, say oh but it's too old, you know, the the, flat, the harmonics are not so good, uh, the bow is not going so fast, the, it's the, clear, the sound is not so clear. And I told him, shut up, sorry, shut up. Please uh, remember this, this man. This man has the force and the energy to come mm -hmm. to us and to play for us, Paganini's Capriccios, at, at 86 years. And if you if you are listening, really listening you can listen how much music was inside so i don't care if harmonics are not perfect i don't care if the, if the, the there are some some notes some small notes missing but mm -hmm. the energy and the musicality of this man i i have still here and this was the same with vera dulova mm -hmm. no absolutely true absolutely true she i was, have to yeah 
And so, as you told before, maybe it wasn't perfect, but we don't have to care about the perfection. We have to care about the music and the artistry, and the artistry in the music, in the performance. Yeah, and it's very special because every person is really different. And uh, especially when you mentioned uh, Vera Dlova, she didn't need to play. She only, she entered the stage and you had such a respect to that exactly. person, you know, from, from, from what she as a personality was. That's something very, this is nothing that you can learn. It's something that you are having like a gift from above. So I think that these people we should really carry with a, with a big, big admir admiring and um, yeah, big, big respect. Even big respect uh, and not forget about them. Uh, of course, <clears throat> I was laughing. At, <clears throat> sorry, <clears throat> I was laughing about myself. About uh, uh, laughing, I was criticizing myself uh, while playing uh, Peshet and so on. Because of course, uh, I was nineteen, and as everybody, I had the chance to 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 study with other people and to I hope improve. But uh, I don't want to criticize so hard myself uh, as anybody of us because we there were other way of playing also and other way um, there are 33 years of music and discovery and uh, uh, rediscovery of uh, um, uh, way of playing and um, the, the the right practices for ancient music or the right practices for modern music or uh, uh, a lot a lot of development in music and in harp playing as well so uh, i think uh, uh, you are making uh, something important something so important because it's a treasure uh, treasure for everybody thank you thank You're you welcome <laughs> <laughs> I'm really glad for that and for your words and for your time and for all your experiences and all your words which you were able to share with us because I, I am very, very, very thankful for everything. It's so important to share these this really known knowledges and know-how with the world and um, that's very unique. And I wish really, Nicoletta, you all, all my best because, um, yeah, and I'm... I really hope that we will see very soon in prison yeah. as well, so that we will be able to, to see in uh, in Italy or anywhere else. Maybe you come to Prague again, <laughs> so it will be lovely. Oh, you come to Trieste to visit us, as Absolutely. you promised me, as you promised me. <laughs> <laughs> I wish, and I, I keep my promises, so I will, I will certainly come. And uh, I wish you mainly now health, so that everything is over as soon as possible, so that we can be lucky again free for for making our music yeah. so public and uh, to yeah to meet all together so that i hope that it will not be coming back and that we don't need to log, be locked down in half a year again and that the next year congress will really happen that we can certainly meet there again. yeah that we will mainly really be all healthy and we have there again another message from Sionet, uh from i think that it's for you nicoletta and yeah so that she's happy to meet you so i <laughs> so i i had a wonderful good discussion with Sionet in um, in uh, in dublin and we shared we shared the concert uh, in um we shared the concert. Uh, we shared the concert. We had uh, several, some, uh, you know, concert with new music, uh, and uh, and we shared also the music. <laughs> <laughs> and we the it was absolutely fantastic as well. Phenomenal. You will you will hear her on on Sunday. So also don't miss it. And yeah, Nicoletta, I thank you very very much. And I'm thank you. forward very much now to listen to your performance. I will try to download it now as soon as possible. <laughs> I hope it will not last so long, but we will hear you. And I, because I am now, I moved uh, and I don't have the program. You will see the program. I, you will be, it will be posted. So you will see what, who is, who else is performing at the same concert with you. And um, I kiss you again. Take care. Thank you, you very too. much for your time. Thank you, everybody who was with us today. And I'm looking forward to tomorrow again at five o'clock uh, to see each other. So I will. Thanks a lot. Thank thanks care. a lot, Lata. Thanks a lot. Big ass to everybody and stay Bye. healthy. Stay healthy. Indeed. You too. Thank you, Nicoletta. Take care. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.